This is section 5.8, part 5. Doing long division. When we set up our long division, we need to make sure that our variables are in order, and this one is not. Let's double check that everything is there. If everything is there, then it's just a matter of reordering them when we set up our division. My largest exponent is a 3. I have a second power. I have a first power. I have a constant. They're all there. I need, just need to get them in the right order. Okay, that's easy. Set in the bottom, second power, first power, constant. They are there. They are in order. So let's set this up. 2m squared minus 3m plus 6 divided into 8m cubed minus 18m squared plus 37m minus 13. Okay, let's concentrate on our first terms again. This looks like a much harder problem, but this one is actually longer than this one. What do I need to multiply the two by to get to two m squared to get to eight m cubed? I need to multiply it by a four. Here I have two of them, I have three of them here, I need one more, so I need to multiply by a four m. Now I take this 4m and I need to distribute it through all of these. 4m times 2m squared is 8m cubed. 4m times negative 3m is minus 12m squared. 4m times 6 is positive 24m. I am subtracting, so I need to change every sign. Our first term should cancel out, and it does. Negative 18 plus 12 will be negative 6m squared. 37 minus 24 is 13m. And now I'm going to bring down this minus 13. Repeat the process. 2m squared needs to become negative 6m squared. The m squared is already correct. I need to change this 2 into a negative 6. So I need to multiply it by a negative 3. Take the negative 3 and distribute it through all the way, all the way through here. Negative 3 times 2 is negative 6m squared. Negative 3 times negative 3m is going to be positive 9m. Negative 3 times 6 is negative 18. Change all of the signs. Your first term should cancel out. 13m minus 9m gives me 4m. Negative 13 plus 18 is plus 5. Now this whole thing here is my remainder. I know it's a little bit ugly, but what you want to check for is you remember back when we first started talking about polynomials, we talked about the degree, and the degree was the largest exponent that appears. The degree here is 1, because the largest exponent on my m is a 1. Here my largest exponent is a 2, so the degree here is 2. As long as this degree is smaller than this degree, it's okay to be a remainder. Okay, So this answer as ugly as it looks, is 4m minus 3 plus 4m plus 5 over all of this, 2m squared minus 3m plus 6, and I'm extending my fraction bar to make sure it's long enough. Okay. Now I definitely want to do a check on this one so that you can see that adding that ugly remainder still works. I'm going to take 4m minus 3 
and multiply it by 2m squared minus 3m plus 6. And then I'm going to add to that, after I do the multiplication, I'm going to add 4m plus 5. I need to distribute here. 4m times 2m squared is going to be 8m cubed. 4m times negative 3m is negative 12m squared. 4m times 6 is 24m. Now let's distribute the negative 3. Negative 3 times 2m squared is negative 6m squared. I'm lining up my like terms to make it easy. Negative 3 times negative 3m is going to be positive 9m. Negative 3 times 6 is negative 18. I'm going to combine all this and then add 4m plus 5. Okay, so let's combine here. 8m cubed, there's nothing to match with that. Negative 12 minus 6, that's minus 18m squared. 24 plus 9 is 33m minus 18 plus 4m plus 5. Now let's combine like terms here. 8m cubed minus 18m squared. Add these two and you get 37m. Negative 18 minus 5 is minus 13. It's in a different order, but you can see that we have exactly the same things. So our answer is correct.